Hey guys, welcome to Vlogmas Day 2. It is November, no, it is December 1st right now. I just finished up taking my anatomy exam that I had to do today over muscles. And I'm heading home because I'm tired. It is cold. It is currently 39 degrees outside according to my car. And I am freezing. So I am now sitting in the parking lot. And I'm debating going and getting coffee. I think I'm just going to make some at home though. And then I'm going to go home and read. And finally catch up on all the reading I have to do. Maybe study a little bit. I'm not sure about that yet, but that's a possibility. It is the weekend though, and I'm excited. But I will catch up with you guys when I get home. All right, guys, my initial plan when I got home was to make coffee, and then I was gonna get work done, like blog work, which, no. There, you can see my laptop is going. But I came home and it was like maybe 65 degrees in this house. It's freezing. And our pellet stove isn't working. It is actually 64. It is cold. So, I've been trying to get that fixed, and I've also been watching Vlogmas. To be more specific, Nikki Blackadder's Vlogmas, and this is day one of hers, so. That is that. I'm hoping to get the pellet stove working again. But if not, haha, I see it's lighting. That's a plus. If not, I might just, like, warm it up in here with the heat, and then maybe make coffee and get some work done. After that, hopefully, once I get the post for today, tomorrow, Monday up, I am hoping to read and get a lot of that done. So I'll talk to you guys in a little bit. All right, you guys, I realized I could probably show you how I do my coffee every day because I do it differently. I don't just put coffee in a coffee maker. I do pour over coffee. So why not show you guys how I do that? First, I'm starting off with this Starbucks mug. It's kind of on the small side, so I'll probably make a few cups with this, but I'm gonna go ahead and start with this and put, it's not actually cinnamon dulce syrup, it's, fuck. It's a Torani pumpkin spice syrup, and I usually use about seven pumps of this in here. I'll probably do about five this time. Now that the syrup is in there, let's get our creamer. I also use the Cliff of Farms almond milk creamer that also has like the coconut in it. I don't know if this one does or not, but you, they mostly do. My favorite is the pecan caramel because of the flavor. And now let's go and get our coffee put in. First things first, I gotta get a coffee filter and put in the other filter. That way it's just easier for cleanup. Plus, I, I always fold it up like this. That way it's just easier to fit into the small container. Just put it in there. Open it up in the process. Ah. That sound is the um, kettle. So I pour boiling water into it. And I usually let that cool down for a second. Okay, put it in there. Haha, -ha. and now it's safe. Now let's get our coffee. I lately have been loving the Starbucks Anniversary Blend. I actually have this ground for me at my store, the one I used to work at. I'm going to open this up and I'm going to use about five scoops. I'm going to go ahead and scoop this in and then I'm going to start making it. Okay, our coffee is in. That's about as much coffee as I use. And now that this is cooled this is cool down a little bit because if I use straight boiling water, it burns the coffee grounds. I don't know why. So let's go and pour in here. Try to get all the grounds wet. Let it sit and go down for about 10 seconds. And watch it pour down. So there. And now continue. Make sure you get all the grounds wet every time. And pretty much do this until it fills up to about the four cut mark. Maybe a little bit above. And I'll be back with you guys when it's done. All right, guys, it's completely filled up. It's going to take this over here so I can empty out the grounds. Because that's for them after they've been used. Pull it out of there, dump. Bring the coffee back. This is a lot of coffee this time, guys. You should take this out, sink. Time to pour my coffee in my cup. There we go. Leave a little bit of room for the creamer. Set this off to the side. That's gonna be a lot of coffee tonight. Shake this up first, hold on. There. 
and it exploded all over itself. That is wonderful. There we go. No, there's Lid back on. I'm gonna go and wipe this off, and now we have our coffee. Time to go work on vlog stuff. Also, in case you guys were wondering, the stove is actually working again. It is so nice and it's warm, and I can feel the heat from here. But now I'm gonna go ahead and get my agenda so I can at least figure out what post I have to do today. I know I have to do a TBR for the Hooked on Books readathon for next week. Which is going to be fun because that's the week before finals. Might not do it. I'm not quite sure yet. I'm still thinking about it. And then I, and then I also have to do a November wrap up possibly. I'm not sure about that yet because of the fact that I might not. I don't think I read much in November. I only think I read one book if that. So we'll see how that goes. And I'm, I'll check in with you guys probably a little bit later. I'm also going to try to upload all this footage to my computer because it is taking a lot of space on my phone. All right, guys, I finally finished all my blog posts for the rest of the week. I'm going to do my Monday one, to probably tomorrow, because I don't feel like writing anymore. I'm tired. I want to read. I need to make me another cup of coffee, because I had two cups earlier in this mug, which is quite dirty on the inside now. And I also had a Mountain Dew, which I am also almost out of. So I'm going to go and probably make me another cup of coffee. Going to read. But I'm gonna go ahead. And he I'm gonna go ahead and end the vlog here. That way, I can go ahead and also get this edited and uploaded for you guys. That way, it will be up tomorrow morning at like 10 ish. Well, it'll be today at like 10 ish for you guys, but tomorrow for me, whatever. And yeah, tomorrow's vlog will probably be a little bit more boring than this because I preferably am not leaving all day. I am going to go to the gym once, maybe get me coffee, maybe go study at the school, but other than that, not a whole lot going on. Just a lot of reading done, and a lot of homework, and a lot of studying. So, yeah, I'm just going to go and end it here. Like I said, I will talk to you guys tomorrow, and stay nerdy.